Hey everyone, welcome to the video. Just doing another quick update in the lab I posted yesterday. Things did change, so I'm just letting you all know. I did switch to Patrick Mahomes. I was fading him for Andrew Luck, but I'm just not very comfortable with that. The Chiefs are giving up 34 points on the road, but when they're at home, they're only giving up 18 points per game, and it's a big playoff game, so I had to think they're a little hyped up. So that moved me on to Patrick Mahomes. I know the Colts defense has been pretty good as of late, but... The quarterbacks they've been playing have not been very good. So I think Mahomes and the Chiefs can roll. And I moved to Todd Gurley. So looking at some of the Cowboys' home road splits, they are just an abysmal team on the road. And I, th and the, I think the Rams are going to put up a lot of points. So I want Todd Gurley. They're favored by 7.5 points. And I think he's just in for a big game. They said he's feeling healthy enough. So I'm on on that. And he's got a huge receiving game upside as well. Damian Williams, Spencer Ware's out, so he's all good to go. Probably my favorite play of the slate. Robert Woods, he's going to be against Anthony Brown. He's going to avoid Byron Jones and the Cowboys' really good corners, so I think Robert Woods is a good play. Ted Ginn, he's one of my favorite plays. Uh, Eagles aren't very good against deep balls, and I have to think the Eagles are going to double Michael Thomas, so that should leave Ted Ginn one-on-one -on -one against some really bad corners like Maddox. Golden Tate, he's got the P.J. Williams. Uh, P.J. Williams matchup, he had eight targets last week. I think this is a really good play. There should be trailing, so he's going to get a lot of uh, volume. Travis Kelsey, I think he's just a must play. The Colts have given up 107 receptions to the tight end position this year, last in the league. I think it's just a smash spot. I wouldn't be surprised if Mahomes and Kelsey had two touchdowns together. <laughs> and Eric Ebron bringing it back with the, one of the Colts players. I like stacking up the Chiefs, so I'm going to bring it back with the Colts player, and he's got the best matchup of them all. Chiefs defense has just been equally as bad as the Colts defense to the tight end position, and Ebron's got two, three touchdown upside here in this game. I really like having these two tight ends from this game, and it's the highest over-under. And the Chargers, they have the lowest over-under game, and I do think the Chargers win, and Tom Brady has struggled under pressure, so I'm hoping Joey Bosa and that Chargers, def Chargers defensive line can create some pressure and get some turnovers, and I think this is just a sloppy game overall, so I like the Chargers defense out of all of them this week. All right, guys, that's all I have for this week, and that was the final update, and this is what I'm rolling with, so I, if you have any questions, let me know. Leave a like and subscribe to the channel, and good luck this week. I hope we all win.